Hey Wolves! I'm Miss Montgomery and I am the principal here at Mountain View. And I'm Miss Rotel and I'm the assistant principal. It has been roughly 165 students days since we've last had you in our building and sitting in our desks and learning from our teachers in person. And we are thrilled to be welcoming you back next week. We've been working really hard on campus to get the campus ready to invite students back in a safe way. So please take a minute to watch this video and learn what you'll expect when you come to campus next week. See you soon, Wolves! As you're getting ready to come to school, here are the items you should bring with you each day. First, you want to wear a face covering and pack an extra for just in case. You want to bring your Chromebook and make sure it's charged. Pack a water bottle in your backpack because the water fountains won't be available. And you're going to want to bring any other school supplies you might typically need. As you arrive at school, you want to make sure that your face covering is on and you're ready to start the day. Students that are walkers or are dropped off will enter through the attendance door or the main entry. And bus riders will enter through the rear commons doors. As you're waiting to enter the building, stand six feet apart and wait in line. As you enter the school, you'll do a temperature check. Pay attention and make sure you follow all directions so the process goes quickly. Also, as a reminder, stay home if you are not feeling well. If you're getting breakfast, you'll pick it up from the front of the commons. Tables will be set up in the commons. These tables are for students eating breakfast only. Make sure if you're eating breakfast that you sit at a table with a green sign that means that it's clean. When you're finished eating, put your face covering back on, flip the sign on your table over to red for dirty, throw away your trash, and then find a place in line standing six feet apart. At 7.10, when you're released from the commons, head directly to your first period. If your first period is in the gym, you need to exit the breezeway door and get a ticket to indicate that you've gotten your temperature taken. If your first period is in the portables, you need to exit the commons door closest to the stage and get a ticket as well. When you're in the hallways, you want to keep to the right hand side, you want to keep moving forward at all times, and you want to keep your mask on. You also want to do your best to socially distance. During passing periods and other times where you're in the hallway, you want to go directly to your destination, which should be your next class or the restroom. When you're waiting to enter the class, line up socially distanced in the designated line areas until your teacher brings you into the class. As you enter class, you want to go directly to your seats that have been socially distanced. You also want to continue to wear your mask. After class, your teacher will spray your desk with a soapy water solution. You'll use a paper towel to thoroughly wipe your table and desk area. Then, you'll wipe the back of your seat. As you leave the classroom, you'll throw your paper towel away. If you have any shared electronics that you used in the class, they'll be cleaned with a teacher-provided alcohol wipe. When going to the bathrooms, we want a maximum of two people in the bathroom at one time. Be sure that you practice good hand hygiene and wash your hands for 20 seconds before you leave as well. Now let's talk about lunch. You want to wait until you're signaled to enter the commons. You're going to find a table and sit down with no more than two people per table. When your zone is called, if you're getting a school lunch, proceed to the line. Hand sanitizer is available at all three lunch lines. If you brought your own lunch, you can sanitize your hands at the designated stations on your way in. When you're done eating, you have the option to stay at your table or go outside. If you choose to go outside, your options are to hang with your friends, socially distance, play volleyball, football, or foursquare. If you choose to use equipment, place it in the dirty bin when you're finished. At the end of the lunch period, all students will return to their tables to wipe down the table and seat backs of their chairs. Then they'll stand behind the tables until dismissed to go back to class. Now let's take a look at dismissal procedures. At 1.35, the first round of bus riders and students being picked up will be dismissed. Please head directly to the bus pickup and find your bus line. At 1.42, the second round of bus riders and walkers will be dismissed. If you're waiting to be picked up, keep your face covering on and practice social distancing. We know that school looks a little different this year. 
It's important to remember that the new protocols are designed to help keep everyone in our community safe and healthy. We need everyone to do their part to follow these protocols, and we look forward to seeing you soon.